Hey guys, welcome back. Well, we got the uh, modifications done to stabilize our hover note. I think about as best as we're going to get her. Now this is the original uh, rotor blade of my fingers. Okay, now the new one that's on here came off my uh, YD-911 helicopter. It was a spare one that came with it. And uh, it actually works really well. You know, and there's a considerable size difference here between the two. Okay, as you can see. So the other little modification we did for the counterweight was we took some brass and uh, it was already drilled out. It was a piece of scrap. And I just fine-tuned the, the length of it. And for now, I've taped it here. I'm actually going to end up probably JB welding it in place and uh, then painting it black so you can't really see it. Because right now, you know, you can tell it's been taped. But uh, it's a good start. And at least I got the, the weight in the right place. So um, let's give this a little bit of a flight for you and show you how she's working now. So it hovers a lot better now. Forward. And so, uh, rushy rush. And we now have our reverse back. Now it hovers pretty darn good. And that, that's the pro mode. So here's normal. There's our forward for normal. And our reverse for normal. And we're back to pro again. And our forward. And our reverse. So now it's just a little cosmetic to change and uh, to get rid of the tape part. And uh, we'll uh, have this one uh, all done. Nice to move landing. So there we have it. A uh, little bit of brass on the back of the uh, tailpiece here for to counterbalance the weight of the battery up front. We still get to keep our battery concealed and uh, easily changeable. Um, I put the locking screw back into the canopy too, um, but because um, I just finished changing the battery, so I got quite a bit of flight time out of that battery at a thousand milliamps. So um, anyway, that's uh, our modified uh, 052 interceptor, and uh, I think that's about as far as I'm going to take this thing, and uh, we'll move on to the next project. Thanks for watching.